Welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're playing some Slime Rancher and we have unlocked Victor's workshop. So if we go over to our lab area, we have a star sign that says we need to go over here. So we are going to follow this rule and head over this direction. The side of here is, whoa, we have, okay, what's this? Can we store, we can't store our slimes in here. Ah! <laughs> What a useless storage space. Okay, right, I wonder what this place is, huh? There's Victor's phone call box over here. Let's see what he wants. Hello, Beatrix. Thank you for taking the time to assist me with this project. It is a matter of great importance. That is something. My apologies. I am in the middle of some delicate work and sometimes forget I'm wearing my immersion field. Now, now when? The matter of how I need some assistance testing an in-development simulated reality of the far, far range. I am attempted to use this simulation to predict the slime's behavior and evolution. Alternatively, you can call it a slimulation. God, this guy's crazy. Jesus Christ. I had calculated a response for at least a mild chuckle from that word, please. Oh my God, he's listening in, guys. Oh my God, this is scary. But no matter, let's proceed. My slimulation is an infinity complex project that could be the key to understanding slimes on a level that we've never dreamed. However, it's sadly riddled with bugs. While not bugs per se, technically speaking, there are flaws in the simulation that slimes have discovered a way to replicate. Fascinating in its own right, but very much destructing in my studies. I call these entities glitch slimes, and I need you to come and collect me for them to study. Okay, yeah, I could do that, easy. Here's how it works. Enter the slimulation and begin exploring. Your goal is to collect the glitch slimes, which will automatically be turned into bug reports upon exiting the simulation. However, this is easier than said than done. And glitch slimes are exhibited a curious behavior of conforming to their surroundings, perhaps to avoid detention from me. It's not clear. Refocusing that this course, glitch slimes will look like normal slimes and objects within the environment. Something is usually off about them. Reveal them, back up the suspicious entities, use my handy debug spray, on the suspicious objects in the environment. As a reward for your efforts, I'll grant you a manifold cube and a special multi-purpose resource I invented, which you can use for fabricating unique gadgets from the blueprints you'll find in your slimulation. As we conclude each major phase of our work, I'll grant you with additional rewards but more on those later. My research has determined that adding mystery to reward me mechanisms incentive participants to try hard. Oh, and this is really not terribly important, and I'm certain it's quite nearly under control, but due to a data corrupt in the slimulation, they will reach a point where tar-like entities will begin appearing and take over the slimulation, and you should really get out right away. Okay, no problem. Oh my god, he keeps talking. When this occurs, I'll be sure to signal a beacon on the first available location where you can safely log out. Just follow the exit markers when you see them all. They'll lead you to the exit portal. Okay, great. Glad you have no questions at all, especially at the last bit. So uh, let's get to work. Okay, I understand it mostly. So we just got to go inside of this slimulation. Let's press the button. Ah, oh, okay. Let's press the button. And we're going in. Okay, so from what it looks to be is we are at our place with... Oh my god, that's cool. It's all loading in very slowly. That's cool. Okay, so what is around here? Wait for an exit. Uh, okay, and where's the debug spray? There it is. Found this debug spray. 
So this area is very similar to um, our main area. So we're looking for glitches in the environment. I don't know where or what we could be looking for. Could it be a fence? Could it be... I found a portal back and... Oh, that's a... Uh, okay. I don't know what that is over there. Should we go have a look at that? Oh, no, it's gone. That's really weird. I wonder what that was. Uh, okay, that wasn't the slime. Hmm. Wait, wait. Oh, my God. It, they don't have proper faces. What? Quick, quick. Come here. Thank you. You're mine. Now we're looking for the slimes that don't have proper faces. There's another one. There we go. And mine, 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 mine. There we go. Uh, you are also broken. Why are all of these slimes broken for? <laughs> right, let's keep going. What's in this area? So we have ourselves more glitchy slimes here. Mine. We don't even need the bug reports to collect the slimes. We just need to vac them up like this and then they explode. I don't know if that's a bug or anything else, but... And um, we can continue going this way as well, so we'll throw away all of our random stuff. And what's this? Oh, okay, can't go that way. Nah, I thought you were... thought you were a broken slime. Can we go up this way? What's up this way? Oh, we've got a, a reload area. Okay. And looks to be some sort of parkour area. There, there's not much. <gasps> oh my god! I was like, these trees... They, they don't look normal, and I was like, okay, so now we know to, uh, what's that? Oh my god. Oh, it's tar, and if we spray it, it dies, so I guess that's cool. We can keep going then, I guess. There's more holes like this that are appearing, but you guys are all mine. go just collect some more bug reports follow the beacon how do we follow this beacon then there's a beacon this way apparently there's so many of these things we I think error 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 glitch slimes are the bugs of simulations so they don't play by the rules they can escape if you take damage oh god so they can escape Apparently, okay. So I wonder how far away this beacon is then to get back. Are we able to find more slimes along the way? I bet this one. It is as well. Ah, hello. Okay. <laughs> and what about you? You are fake as well. My God. So many fakes. What else is fake? I bet you half of you guys are fake. Yeah. You're all mine. Go away. Bet half of you guys are fake too. At least they're not Tars. Oh, talk of the devils. Um, where is this exit portal at? Ah, it's up here. Just this way. Back through this way. My god. This exit portal is really, really far away. And then we go left. What, what's that tree like? Oh, okay. Oh my god, these are... These are actually, like, getting big and problematic, you know? Oh dear, what is that thing there? Okay, there's the exit portal. Okay, let's go. Are we safe? 
God knows, but let's leave the environment because that was dangerous. And now we are back at our little base with our slimes all over here. And this seems to be what we are able to unlock. But anyway, guys, now that we've unlocked this area, we can go and put our reports into this. We need 100 reports. And what does it give us? A cube. What cube? A manifold cube. A little bit of everything. Okay. We can go put this into our uh, garage now. Oh, we're already here. There we go. Anyway, guys, if you did like this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. If you want to see more episodes like this from me on the channel, leave a comment down below on what you want to see. And if you did like this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And another Woodmill Inc. video will be out shortly. And more Roblox videos too, because I have plenty of them to come out soon. Anyway, guys, I'll see you guys in the next one.